Good day. Today we're going to have a look at level 12 in the Passenger Flow DLC of Train Valley 2. This one's called Grease. So we've got 16 minutes. We can't build more than two bridges, and we can't destroy any track tiles. Okay, so we've got A, B, and D um, of the letter stations, and we're going to get C down here. Uh, and then for our workers, they want 12 glass and 12 gold. Um, so, and then we want 21 rings. So what we want to do is just sort of get our uh, initial setups built. So if we build a bridge just for this guy here, we'll go there, and what we do is go through like that, uh, and then what we'll do is we will connect. D, we'll just do some nice straight lines. Uh, we want to get those guys through connected up here. And uh, we'll want to try and get A connected. Oh, we might want to see if we can get our um, gold operating nice and early too. We'll just try and make that as direct a line as possible. Okay, and that leaves us with 11,000. Um, so what we'll do is just build sort of further away. Um, I think. Go like that. And get that far. Okay. So hopefully we get... Um, what we'll do is we'll send our workers and hopefully one of these two is either a B or a D uh, station. Uh, no luck so far, so what we'll do is we'll just send more workers, make sure they go into the right spot. We'll just get another state. Good, okay, so we can send this train. So initially we're going to need um, this and this, you can see a divisible spike of six, whereas those are divisible of seven. So what we want to do is get our divisible of six stuff done, uh, and then we can start upgrading our trains to the uh, to the sevens. Okay, so everything now is um, coming up as um, A. So what we'll do is we'll just make our connection to A. As soon as we can afford it, which will be when this guy arrives. Okay, so what we'll do is we'll make that join there too, uh, and we'll send this guy on. Now, uh, the other thing that we want to do as well is get sand going down here nice and quick. So as soon as um, we've got to keep an eye on down here, and it'll probably open at a certain point. So we want to keep an eye on the minute marker because at a particular time, this will become available. Uh, and then we want to make sure we get straight on to um, sending trains. Oh, there we go. It's open now. So what we'll do is we'll, once this goes past, we'll start sending our workers, and we'll send two lots of workers down here. And make sure we've got that connected and then do a nice clean connection there too. Okay, so all other things we want to connect is just this guy here, we'll get him joined uh, and then we want to make this join up here as well. Is he going the wrong way? So let's just stop him for a second, because we don't want to just turn him around and get this, um, don't want to waste time with these guys. As they are running, you can see that the black line going around the outside here. We need them in there before that finishes. Okay, so once uh, they're in, what we'll do is we'll just shift a few more of these uh, blues. We'll send him and then send that one, and we'll get them both going to A. Um, we've then got our coal all ready to go, so we'll send that down. 
and we will make this connect so we can have um, workers head in there as well. Now I believe that this is running on a, a full minute cycle so you can see that we're at about two minutes ten so at three minutes that should reopen for another minute. Okay so what we'll do is we'll send um, 12 workers down here and we'll send 12 workers from up here this way. Whoops, he's overshot his target there, so what we'll do is we'll just let him roll through. I will then correct this guy, we'll send him up that way, uh, and then we'll send the second one from this way over here. Now, probably wouldn't hurt to have some guys from here ready to go into this section, but we are also making some nice quick money. Um, so let's just see, can we build through here? We can. Okay, so you can see it's going to cost 100000 to get rid of that building. But once we get rid of that, we can build a tunnel through here and allow us to not rely on this anymore. So that'll be very ideal once, uh, once we have that option. Okay, so we'll move this gold up. We'll move this guy who's not going to be in our way at all. Now that's open, we'll move our sand. Now, we've only used one of our um, bridges, so we'll use our second bridge just here and get C connected, like so. And again, we're still we're probably not trying to rely too heavily on the um, these trains yet, but it would be a nice quick money making move if we did. Uh, so we'll just basically what we're going to have to wait for now is just the two of these to to build. So while they're building, uh, we'll just order up a few more trains. Because there's only 25, so we can hopefully move through them at a decent pace. But now that we've got them in there, what we can do is start to upgrade our trains as well. So we're now operating in trains of six. Um, and to upgrade our whole fleet, uh, we can sort of then just start dealing in, in the sevens. Um, which is what we want to sort of start doing with our uh, remaining sort of time. If that sentence made sense. It's just a good opportunity to try and clear out a lot of these trains before we get too uh, bogged down again. We'll just upgrade a few more trains because it's good quick money too that we're getting. Okay, so that's all our trains upgraded now. And we're only three trains off having um, everyone done. Well, at least we don't have to move the remaining ones. So we'll just try and power through those last few. So we just need to move one more train after this. So what we'll do is we'll move him. And there, so we've got trains sitting at all stations, but there's no urgency to move them anymore. It's just basically money that we'll get uh, if we do move them. Let's have a look at how much this tunnel is going to cost us. 82,000, so we'll build that. Uh, and then we'll just plow through that and make a connection here. Uh, and then come down and make a connection to our route there. And have him join too. Okay, so now that means is we can sort of get guys to sand uh, without too much uh, drama. 
and we'll move our gold ingots and our glass and get them home. Okay, so now what we're going to need is 21 of, of everything. Um, we're going to need 21 glass. So we're going to need 21 sand. So what we'll do is, if, now that these guys have arrived, we'll get our 21 gold going. And we'll get our 21 sand going. So we'll just go the way that means we don't have to stress about this brute. So there's the first 14 guys to both. We'll send another set of guys that'll go up and do this. And this guy, we'll send him uh, some people that'll go and just sort of be the placeholders for the class. And we'll send him up to go in there. send these guys around and they can go be the second lot for the glass for now. So then while we're waiting for the rest of it, we'll try and finish up the remainder of our uh, letters. And basically here we're just waiting to build up our workforce a bit more. Uh, we'll get these blue trains out of there and that'll leave us with just that C since this is still open we'll just take advantage and get the first lot through while it'll be quick we'll send nine more workers that way uh, sorry, seven more workers rather, and then we'll send seven down that way. Actually, we'll send these seven down to the sand. And we'll send this guy just to finish them off. We'll send these guys up here. Okay, then we'll send our gold up. And our second lot of gold. And we'll follow them up with some workers. another set of workers and we'll send this set of workers down uh, in here and then we'll send these guys down to join up here and while this is open again we'll um, send our sand down Okay, so what that means is that we've got our 14 of that all good. Uh, we're missing a man. No, we're all good. Okay, so we've got 14 going. We've got the next seven, next seven, next seven guys all for that. Uh, we've got our glass ready to go. So we won't, we'll just be safe than sorry, and we'll send our glass the long way around to here. Follow that up with seven guys that can go in here too. And once this seven's done, we'll send them down. 
so we can get our rings started production. Then what we can do is send our remaining seven uh, resources up here to, to have that all ready to build. So follow that up with some workers, and then follow that up with some coal. Or is that ore? Oh, coal, cool. Okay, so now what we need to do is then just send our next load down here. Then follow that up with some workers. Then follow that up with some gold. Okay, and so what we'll do is we'll just get rid of the first lot of those rings so it can continue to build. And once that train is out of the way, uh, we'll send the next lot of ingredients. Okay, so we can send this guy out. This uh, bridge is open for now, so we may as well just send him this way. Okay, and that'll be our last lot, so we'll send them this way. Just double check all our tracking to make sure it's all good. It should be. There we go, five stars. Uh, any questions or comments, feel free to chuck them below. I think that building this um, tunnel here is probably the key to, to getting this level done on time. Um, there's my world rankings if you're curious. But yeah, any questions or comments, feel free to chuck them below. Uh, if you had a different strategy, I'd love to hear about it as well. But until next time, I'll catch you later. See ya.